Hello everyone! Today we are here in the beautiful city of Catania to introduce you the Veratron VMH35 Outboard Engine Kit. We will use this all-inclusive kit to install a VMH35 system on two boats today. The first one is on the new Saver 19 Open with the configuration powered by a 40 HP Suzuki outboard engine. The second one is on a Joker boat, equipped with a 200 HP Evinrood engine, where we will refit the outdated NMEA 2000 instrumentation with the new generation VMH35 display. The VMH35 outboard engine kit is a complete monitoring system for both analog and NMEA 2000 outboard engine applications. It includes all you need to monitor vessel and navigation information, from engine data, tank level, battery status and GPS information are all available and displayed on the stylish and powerful VMH35 display. Let's have a look at the content of the kit then, which is delivered in a compact single packaging. The main component is the VMH35 display, the visible part of the system. It's a stylish and compact dashboard instrument with mineral glass and sun-readable color display, which has outstanding outdoor performance with very low power consumption. Additionally, it integrates a high-performance GPS receiver, which integrates speed, compass and position into the engine data information. Another critical component of the system is the intelligent battery sensor, designed to accurately and reliably monitor your energy supplies by delivering a lot of insights of your batteries such as temperature, state of charge, state of health and autonomy. All these parts of the system are easily connected by the provided wire harness designed to make the system installation as easy as possible. Dedicated connectors are provided to interface the engine and all the components of the kit, including additional plugs to further expanding the system with optional accessories. The installation is as simple as it sounds. The VMH35 is installed on the panel through a standard 85mm hole and it's fastened on it by means of the spin lock nut then we installed the intelligent battery sensor, which is simply clamped onto the negative terminal of the 12 volt battery. A pole adapter is included to have the sensor integration done in a snap. The provided wire harness brings everything together. On one end of it, we have the watertight connector for the display, which is plugged and secured with the safety lock. Just after that, we have all the connectors required to easily interface both the power supply and the analog tachometer and trim sensors coming from the engine. On the other end of the 6 meter harness, we have the connectors for the IBS, respectively for the sensor and for the positive terminal of the battery, with an inline water sealed 3 amper fuse. Another 6 meter cable is available on the harness to optionally connect a level sensor into the system. The connector perfectly matches the Veratron liquid level sensors, so to have also in this case a plug and play installation. The system is now ready to go, and thanks to the NMEA 2000 converter embedded into the display, all the data are also delivered to your multifunctional display. The installation on the Joker boat follows exactly the same procedure as in the first one, with a little difference due to the Evinrude engine being equipped with NMEA 2000. In this case, all the engine information like the tachometer, trim and alarms are transmitted to the display in a digital form. The NMEA 2000 plug directly connects into the VMH35 which is NMEA 2000 certified, and all the engine data are instantly available on it. And this installation is also done thanks to the Veratron outboard engine kit. Special thanks goes to Dakimar and Nautica Glam for the hosting and great support during this project to introduce you the benefits of the Veratron outboard engine kit. Thanks for watching, and now let's go boating.